Musa Celebi, July 5, 1413, was an Ottoman prince, Turkish, Sayyid, and a co-ruler of the empire for three years during Ottoman interregnum. The name Celebi is an honorific title meaning gentleman, see pre-1934 Turkish naming conventions. Musa was one of the sons of Bestai. The Ottoman Sultan. There is no consensus of his mother's origin. She was either the daughter of the Bey of the Turkish Germanids or a Byzantine princess. After the Battle of Ankara in which Bestai was defeated by Tamerlane, Musa as well as Best himself was taken as a prisoner of war by Tamerlane. However, after Best's death in 1403, he was released. He returned to the Ottoman Empire, which was now in turmoil and tried to access the throne in Bursa the Anatolian capital of the empire in 1403. However, three of his brothers were also claimants to Ottoman throne, in Asia, Isa Celebi in Borgza and Mehmet Celebi in Amazur, and in Europe, Suleiman Celebi in Edirne, the European capital. The Ottoman Empire at the time had two capitals, since the declining Byzantine Empire in Constantinople separated the two parts of the Ottoman lands. Isa defeated Musa and captured Bursa. Musa took refuge in Germanid territory, where he waited for a suitable moment to try again. In 1406, Mehmet, who had defeated Isa, became the sole ruler of an Anatolian portion of the empire. But he was no match for Suleiman of the European portion. Mehmet and Musa met in Xa in central Anatolia and formed an alliance against Suleiman. Most of the Beliks in Anatolia also supported this alliance. According to the terms of the alliance, Musa was transferred to European part over Black Sea where he allied himself with Mercia of Wallachia. Suleiman now had to fight in two fronts on two sides one against Mehmet in Anatolia and another against Musa in Europe. This strategy was partially successful, as Suleiman gave up his hopes to conquer the Anatolian portion of the empire. However, he was able to defeat Musa. Despite his defeat, Musa continued with hit-and-run tactics against Suleiman up until 1410. Meanwhile, Suleiman had lost most of his previous allies due to his uncontrollable temper. In 1411, Musa's tactics finally gave victory and he captured e. Turn The defeated Suleiman, while attempting to escape into Byzantine territories, was killed by villagers on February 18, 1411 and Musa found himself as the co-sultan of the European portion of the empire. As a co-sultan, the details of previous Mehmet Musa alliance are not clear. Musa declared himself the sultan of European portion of the empire while Mehmet viewed Musa as his vassal. Musa besieged Byzantine Constantinople, modern Istanbul, as retribution for Manuel II Palaiologos's support for Suleiman during the previous battles between Musa and Suleiman. Manuel II Palaiologos turned to Mehmet for support, who betrayed Musa and set up a new alliance between himself and the Byzantines against Musa. In 1411 and in 1412, Mehmet's forces clashed with Musa's and in both cases Musa was defeated. In 1413, Mehmet gained the support of Serbian monarch Stefan Lazarevic and the Bey of the Turkish Dulcadirids, as well as some of the generals in Musa's army. He defeated Musa's forces in the Battle of Samalu near Samakov, Bulgaria. 1. Injured and trying to escape, Musa was spotted and killed on July 5, 1413. Aftermath Musa's death ended the Ottoman interregnum. His brother Mehmet Celebi became Sultan Mehmet I however, in 1416, Sheikh Bedretin, one of Musa's former allies, chief military judge, the Kars Aska, led an unsuccessful revolt against Mehmet I. Other events that may be viewed as the continuation of the interregnum were the two rebellions of Dusmis Mustafa Celebi, another one of Best's sons and one of Musa's, Mehmet's and Suleiman's brothers who had been hiding in Anatolia. Mustafa was a fifth claimant to throne and he fought against both his brother Mehmet in 1516 and his nephew Murat II in 1521 unsuccessfully. 